In this video, we're going to show you how you can fix your Nintendo Switch 2 if it's not connecting to Wi-Fi or you're having network issues. Before we get into this, make sure to like and subscribe. It really does help out the channel. But to begin, go ahead and press and hold on the power button on top of your console. After about four to five seconds, this menu is going to go ahead and appear. Go ahead and select power options and then choose power off to completely shut down your console. Now the next step is actually not on your Nintendo Switch, but you're going to want to go ahead and unplug your modem and or router for about 30 to 60 seconds and then plug it back in. After that, simply turn on your Switch 2 again and check if the Wi-Fi actually connects. If it's still not connecting for you, go ahead and go to the selection section on the bottom of the homepage and select system settings. Scroll down until you find the internet option and then go over to internet settings. Keep in mind for poor connection, it could be that your console is too far from the router or there's interference. You could also try moving closer to the router and removing any obstructions like metal objects or electronics in the way. If that doesn't solve it, go ahead and select your current Wi-Fi network and then hit clear settings. This will remove the network from your Switch 2. Now go ahead and refresh this page by backing out and then going back in and reconnect to that Wi-Fi by selecting it again and then entering in your password. That being said, if that's still not working for you, select that Wi-Fi network again and go to change settings. Scroll down in this option until you find the DNS settings and change it from automatic to manual. For the primary DNS option that's going to pop up, you're going to want to go ahead and type in 8.8. Point eight, point eight. You could also type in 1.1.1.1 if you're still having issues. For the secondary DNS though, you're going to want to type in 8.8.4.4 and for Cloudflare, choose 1.0.0.1. If you have any questions on what those means, just leave a comment, we can help you out there. But after entering in your preferred DNS, simply select save and then test out Wi-Fi again. One more time, if you're still having issues, go back to your internet settings, hit the change settings option again, and scroll all the way down until you find the MTU option and change it from 1400 to 1500. This is the default on PS5s and Xbox, and it may help with packet size and connection efficiency. I know that was a lot, but if you have any questions, feel free to ask us down in the comments below, and remember to like and subscribe.